Do you know what foods could be causing inflammation in your body? Today, we're embarking on an enlightening journey, peeling back the layers of our daily diet to reveal the hidden culprits behind inflammation. You see, the food we eat can either fight inflammation or fuel it, and it's crucial to understand this connection to maintain optimal health. So, what are these inflammatory foods you might be unknowingly consuming? Well, let's dive in. Starting from number 11, we have fried foods. Picture those crispy golden brown fries, or perhaps a heaping plate of chicken wings. While they may be delicious, they're also loaded with trans fats. These notorious fats are known to stimulate inflammation by damaging the cells in the lining of your blood vessels. Moving on to number 10, sugary beverages. Think of your daily cola or that energy drink you reach for mid-afternoon. These drinks are chock full of refined sugars, which can trigger a surge of inflammation-inducing proteins in your body. Not exactly the energy boost you were hoping for, right? At number 9, we find processed meat. Yes, that includes your favorite hot dogs and bacon. Processed meats are high in advanced glycation end products or ages. These compounds can cause inflammation and have been linked to many chronic diseases. Coming in at number 8 is alcohol. While a glass of wine now and then might be beneficial, excessive drinking can definitely lead to inflammation. Alcohol breaks down into acetaldehyde, a potent toxin that can damage your cells and tissues, leading to an inflammatory response. Next up at number 7 are refined grains. These include foods made from white flour like bread, pasta, and pastries. Refined grains are stripped of their nutritious outer layers during processing, leaving only the starchy endosperm. This can lead to a rapid spike in blood sugar, triggering an inflammatory response. And finally at number 6 we have dairy. While dairy products can be a good source of protein and calcium, they can also cause inflammation in people who are lactose intolerant or sensitive to dairy proteins. This inflammation can manifest as digestive issues, skin problems, or even joint pain. These foods might be tasty, but their inflammatory effects could be causing harm to your body. So the next time you reach for that soda or slice of pizza, remember, what you eat can have a big impact on your health. Now let's move on to the top 5 foods that can cause inflammation. First up we have margarine. This butter substitute might seem like a healthier option, but it's actually packed with trans fats. These artificial fats can trigger systemic inflammation, making margarine a sneaky instigator of inflammatory reactions in your body. Next, let's talk about fast food. Fast food is typically high in calories, unhealthy fats, and sugars, all of which can contribute to inflammation. Plus, fast food is often deep-fried, which can produce compounds known as advanced glycation end products or ages. These ages can accelerate inflammation in your body, making that quick burger and fries a less appealing option. Coming in at number 3, we have red meat. While it can be a good source of protein and iron, red meat is also high in saturated fats and is often processed, which can lead to inflammation. Additionally, some studies suggest that a molecule found in red meat called NU5GC might trigger an immune response that can cause inflammation. Our second place goes to gluten. While not everyone is sensitive to this protein found in wheat, barley, and rye, for those who are, it can be a major inflammation trigger. Gluten can damage the lining of the small intestine in people with celiac disease, leading to an inflammatory response. In others, gluten can cause a less severe but still significant inflammatory reaction. And finally, the top spot on our list of inflammatory foods goes to added sugars. These sweeteners can be found in everything from sodas to cereals, and they're a major culprit in causing inflammation. Consuming high amounts of added sugars can lead to increased levels of certain inflammatory markers in the body. Plus, the spike in blood sugar that comes with eating these sugars can also cause an inflammatory response. So these are the top 5 foods that can cause inflammation, with added sugars being the number one offender. So, to recap, inflammation can be exacerbated by the foods we eat. Certain foods like processed meats, sugary drinks, and fried foods can trigger inflammatory responses in our bodies. On the other hand, a balanced diet filled with fruits, vegetables, lean proteins and whole grains can help manage inflammation. It's crucial to remember that our dietary choices play a significant role in our overall health. Remember, what you eat can either fuel inflammation or help to reduce it. Make the right choice for your health. Please subscribe to more Natural Remedy videos. We hope you enjoy watching our videos. Do like, share, and subscribe to our amazing channel.